Hey, full-time fans, yes. time for overtime, brought to you by Modelo. And this is where we have a little fun. We've officially entered t- week 12, and some players are dialed in right oh, now. Sure we are. had this segment early on in the air where we made some calls mm-hmm. to some guys uh, who were just absolutely locked in. So I want to bring out the cellular out devices. Yes. And, 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 Sam, I'm just going through my contacts here. Mm-hmm. Um, oh, oh. Is this for like me? You, you got a call. This is me. Okay, I'll yeah, that's you. All right. Okay, All right. what do we got? Yeah, hello. Ooh, who's oh, we got Amari in Hampton on the on the horn. Amari here. on Hampton. Yes, that would be the running back for North Carolina, <laughs> yeah. who was pretty much single-handedly the reason why they have been winning games. Although they didn't today, but he still ripped off 178 on a Clemson defense that has been much improved. He's second in the country, Scoob, with 123 yards Ooh. per game on the ground. Six straight games with 100 plus rushing yards, including the uh, game today, despite the fact that they did not win. But still, this is one of the most impressive. Running backs in the entire country, he and yet he is not. In. He is not in the Heisman conversation. But we're talking about Ollie Gordon, who's you know, ahead of him. You know they ain't gonna put no Heisman's up in the. I mean, saying. running backs in the Heisman conversation. It, it's a quarterback award, and right now <laughs> I would say it's a Bo Nix versus uh, Jaden Daniels type of award because Jaden Daniels is also balling out. All right, um, I thought we I got, was gonna get a call. We getting more calls or no? Oh, oh. somebody wants to. Up. Somebody wants to talk. Okay. Hello. Oh, oh, it's Jalen Milrow. Oh. <laughs> Jalen Milrow, the Big Alabama time. quarterback. Big time. The dude who tied a career high with three passing touchdowns today. And not only that, he's responsible for 13 touchdowns in the last three games. Milrow had 18 touchdowns responsible for in the first seven games of the season. And he's just turned his game all the way up. Like Fat Joe would say, <laughs> absolute respect to Jalen Milrow with the way that he has lifted this team up uh, to the point where even our group, our YouTube chat, has said that they have faith in Alabama more than Oregon yeah. to potentially win the SEC let, championship. Let me just say that you, you also asked, like, who, who do you have faith in the one loss teams? No other one loss team has Nick Saban. Like that, I don't, that has to play a huge factor yeah. into that. I just, I don't know. I just remember the that. goat. All right, all right. We got a couple got more, a couple more calls we're supposed to accept. Uh, Hold on, I got a ring here. Okay, I'll, I'll be quiet. I'll be quiet. Okay. Hello. Yeah. Uh huh. No, don't worry. I'll tell him. I'll tell him. <laughs> yeah, it's Shador. Shador Sanders, that oh, is. Oh, the Shador. Yeah, the Shador. And he, 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 it sounded like he was in an ice bath or something because he's been sacked 52 times this season alone, but yet he has 3,200 passing yards and 27 touchdowns. Ooh. What's that, Shador? Oh, yeah, I'll tell him. Don't worry about it. Yeah, he's also top five in the nation in passing yards and touchdowns. <laughs> he just wanted to make sure that we got the message out, I think, that, yeah, Shador Sanders, despite his offensive line and some of the struggles they've had, is still having a great season, even though Colorado is losing all the games that they have down the stretch and will not be bowl eligible this year. So, Yeah, I can't believe you know. Shadora gave you a call. Oh, oh. oh. I got friends. Uh, I got a call. Hello? Uh-huh. Okay, yeah, yeah. I, I, I'll tell him to do it. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's Jaden Daniels. What's he say? He said, write it and book it. I am the Heisman, Ooh. all right? Because my boy was responsible for eight touchdowns in his <laughs> game today. If you were watching our show and didn't know, because now you do. This is Lamar Jackson type of energy. Jaden Daniels put up a performance last week where he was responsible for nearly for 600 yards of offense, and then he answers it with this type of game. And he was on SportsCenter and multiple shows this week, mm-hmm. and they were telling him he's going to get the invite to New York. Yeah, yeah, I got you. I'm, oh, he's I'm still on the horn. I'm telling okay. him, I'm, I have my horn. I'm you. telling him, yeah, yeah. So he wants me to tell y'all that forget everybody else on the Heisman, <laughs> book his ticket, give him the award, yes. New York. We on the way. I don't. He, I don't think he's ever been to the Big Apple. The Big either. Apple. He's pretty excited yep. for that. You know what I mean? He's got a chance. Why not? Definitely. Jaden Daniels, welcome to the Heisman <laughs> Trophy Room. Write it and book it. Give me something.